What's good people, hope everyone's doing well. I was just interested in checking out some Call of Duty Vanguard today, seeing how it has aged, and going through some positives and negatives with the game. At the moment, I'm pretty much just running around like a headless chicken, playing, I think, is Domination, I'm pretty sure. So the first positive thing about the game, I would say, has to be the story, right? It's captivating, the atmosphere is very dark and gloomy. Like, especially the first mission, which is Operation Tonga, and how it throws you in the deep end, jumping out of a plane into German-occupied France. Which I think was honestly quite a great start for the storyline to take place. Positive number two. So the multiplayer, in areas where it hits, the game is a lot of fun. In certain aspects, Sledgehammer games have been able to responsibly keep the World War II set and feel alive despite how many games have used the backdrop. Multiplayer modes include in Patrol where you capture and hold the moving zone to earn points for your team. Also combat pacing where Tactical is more of a calculated tense experience and Blitz is a chaotic target rich environment which i think is a great addition to a world war ii style first person shooter like vanguard positive number three is the wide array of maps on multiplayer 27 to be exact maps like berlin desert siege and paradise are among a few favorites of mine with a great layout and map design to engage in some rather interesting 1v1 scenarios if you are enjoying this video, be sure to drop it a like, as that would be much appreciated. It lets me know if you're enjoying these types of videos. And do subscribe, it helps me out more than you can imagine. Thank you. Negative one, in my opinion, is the zombies was quite a letdown. If you were to compare it to um, Black Ops 2 or 3, it's just not quite the same. Furthermore, the fact that it released in such a bad state and didn't follow its roots from Treyarch's World at War that introduced zombies back in 2008 had a lot of people questioning why it came out in the state it did in the first place. Game modes like Terra Maldicta, which means Cursed Earth, and the fact that in this game mode, you need to retrieve currency from dead zombies to be able to acquire body armor, if you have bad teammates as well, you all need to accept an invitation to pass through a portal to progress further into the game. And if your teammates are not cooperating with each other, it can take a long time to progress. So, negative two is the outlandish attachments you can switch from gun to gun. As a consequence of this, you will have an iconic German STG, which has been completely and utterly destroyed by unnecessary optics, barrels and stocks that completely ruin the aesthetic of the game. Here are a few examples so you can understand my point of view. Negative number three, clunky mechanics, slow ADS speeds and irrelevant stims that barely boost speed when trying to flee a gunfight and regain health. I have also noticed some irritating glitchy spots where people camp and cannot be reached. In addition, I'm not a huge fan of the dogs in multiplayer. I enjoyed them in zombies, but not so much in other game modes. I'm really not too sure what map this is, but if anybody can let me know down in the comments, because I'm pretty new to Vanguard. Normally my go-to is um, Modern Warfare 2019, but I thought I'd have a change and see what Vanguard's saying. Um, but yeah, I was just running around with the car 98, trying to get some quick scopes, and just overall messing around to be honest. I've been trying to, you know, level up my skills, trying to get better at quick scoping, just having a little bit of fun really. I don't really play. Vanguard too often, like I said. Um, I want to get back into playing Modern Warfare 2019. But as we all know, we've got Modern Warfare 2 coming out very, very shortly. 
and Warzone 2. So I'm sure there will be a lot of content on this channel about Modern Warfare 2 and Warzone 2. So be sure to stay tuned for that as I'm very excited and I'm sure you are too. I was just running around and you see here, I genuinely thought I'd be able to make this gap, but apparently not. Boom, lovely kill there. We love it. I think we get a, a little cruise missile to almost finish up the round. Get a few little kills of this. Spot on. Just running around trying to find some people. Stim my way out of that. <clears throat> Not too much of a fan of the stims, like I say. They do their job, they regen your health, but they don't give you too much of a speed boost when you want to get away. There you are, it's my last kill. Boom. If you're still here, I do appreciate you. Thanks for sticking around. If you have enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a like and a subscribe if you're new. Thank you. Got a lovely little W there at the end. Peace.